we have over the last several months, and a lot of it happening in May, by the way, when the president launched Operation Warp Speed, we have an American media that rushes out experts, experts, experts in air quotes, who say that it's impossible, it is impossible to get a vaccine done within a year. It is impossible to get a vaccine rolled out by the end of the year. Uh, back in October, when the president said a vaccine would be forthcoming, uh, multiple media outlets and reporters scoffed at this and said it would be impossible, that there was no way this was just the president trying to convince people to vote for him in November, but there would be no vaccine until sometime late next year at the earliest. And then you have these people say, well, you could you could rush out something but we wouldn't have gone through human trials. We wouldn't have tested it. We wouldn't see the long-term effects of it. And so if you get it, you don't want to take it. You have multiple experts on these networks so poisoned in their hatred of Donald Trump. They set their expertise aside and, and serve as partisan commentators to mock and ridicule the president. It is under President Donald Trump's leadership that the American government mobilized the private sector in a public-private partnership and delivered a safe vaccine, or at least we presume it to be safe. But you wouldn't know it from the people on TV who are saying, if it comes out this quick, it's not going to be safe. Now you've got people saying, I'm not going to take it. I would be interested to see if MSNBC had this guy on would he say he's sorry that he was wrong and that he would take the take it? Or will he come out and say, I am not going to take it. It's a Donald Trump vaccine. I'll wait for Joe Biden to be president. Where's Bill Nye, the science guy now? By the way, he's not a sci He's an engineer. He plays a scientist on TV. They let him come on as an expert. The man is not an expert. He's a, he's a TV personality with an engineering degree, and they let him come on as an expert when if you've ever followed anything Bill Nye the Science Guy has said, he is a deeply partisan progressive person. And yet this is who the media puts on as experts. This is who the media wants to be their experts, the people who come on just to undermine the claims of the president, and it turns out the president was right. Turns out the president was right. It turns out the scientists in the private sector could do it. Now, what's so funny is that MSNBC yesterday ran a segment and the Washington Post ran a story. And the Washington Post headline, very much like the, the uh, claims at MSNBC, were that the very deep state and scientists in the private sector the president has long attacked are the ones who came up with the vaccine. That's what they wanted to do. That was their take. Their take was not that they got it wrong. Their take was that all those people the president bashed, they're the ones who came with the, with the timely vaccine. Pay no attention to what we said. Pay no attention to us saying it wasn't possible at all. Pay no attention to any of that. Look at the president. Let's take a bash the president angle. Every angle the media has taken about this virus has been to attack the president of the United States whose administration mobilized the private sector to come up with the cure while these circle of jerks on television were doing what they do best, uh, bashing the president of the United States, oblivious to what was going on, ignorant of what was going on, refusing to talk about what was going on, and now not even having enough intellectual honesty, self-awareness, self-reflection, and humility to say, you know what, we got it wrong. None of them will come out and say we were so interested in owning the president, in beating the president, in bashing the president, we could not acknowledge that the scientists could possibly come up with a safe vaccine by the end of the year. And you know what's going to happen now is there are going to be people who go out and say, I'm just not so sure I want to take this. And they're going to get attacked. Never mind it was the media that had experts on saying, hey, if they rush a vaccine before the end of the year, it's not possible. It's not going to be safe. Don't take it. And the media is never going to own up to the fact that they're the ones who seeded that in people's minds. No, they'll find a way to blame Trump. Everything's got to be about the president. The experts got it wrong. 